In Eliot's poem, Tiresias represents both sexes. It's making me think about what I think of gender in terms of modern day, and it is so many things. And I really like that, that we can be whoever we want to be, and it would be so much kind of easier if we didn't put pressure on ourselves to tick the boxes of, of certain roles when it comes to gender, of, what is deemed as feminine or masculine. And I know that that goes a lot deeper for many people too. And I think to be true to oneself is the most important thing. For me, feminism is simple and it equates to gender equality. It equates to human equality. I actually think there are many shades of feminism and that there is a huge spectrum and that, that is a, a wonderful thing. If you think about the time that Wasteland was written in the 20s and you think about all the years that there have been since and then if you're thinking about feminism specifically there have been ups and downs and triumph and waves and books and discussions and heroes but at the same time has feminism really evolved into, into something that is celebrated? Have we found like equality? Is gender any easier to depict and understand? I'm not sure. I feel like we have a lot of discussion. We maybe talk more. Maybe the world is louder since Wasteland was written. You know what? It's so weird. I keep thinking recently about our obsession with definition. So the idea of renaming feminism, I have thought about this before because I do feel like the word feminist makes people's toes curl, some people's, and I don't really understand why. But I don't know if I would rename it anything. I think the work has been done. Intellectually, it's interesting to explore what feminism means. Historically, it's fascinating. Progressively, it's vital. I enjoy using other words, uh, you know, that I believe in when it comes to human equality and humanism and a sense of fairness and justice. These are all important words around feminism. But um, in terms of do I feel worthy to rename such a heavy thing, I don't. If people come away from a piece of work, like a piece of art, feeling a certain way, particularly if it's an old piece, an old piece of writing, and, and they believe that T.S. Eliot is a secret feminist and that's what people have got from it. Like, I think that that's quite positive.